Welcome back to JT West. Welcome to a bedding video, bedding rolls. So why do I bed rolls? It's always worked great for me in the past. Uh, you know, thank you everybody for tuning in. Before I forget, I always forget that sometimes. But thank you for tuning in. We got the Super A today. And it's probably going to be its biggest workout yet since we've had it. And uh, so we're going to see what she does. Those discs are a pretty good load on it. Those are the discs that we put together. And they're moving a lot of dirt. Um, so we're going to bed this. I'm going to bed all my land. So when I'm ready to plant it, we'll knock it back down, plant it. We won't have to worry about disking or anything like that. If it's rained on it, that's fine. When it dries out, we'll knock it down and plant it gives me a uniform bed and when I plant this we're going to put a measurement of just how tall the so-called bed is you guys will be surprised it's not three or four inches tall it's not very tall at all from where the back feet relative to where the planter is running and all that good stuff but we're going to get it up in the bed this is our Jimmy Redfield you've seen us cut it and she is laying out beautiful I mean, you, you can't get much better than that as far as with a 140, but uh, we'll bed it. We'll stop by the Hastings and bed it. Now I won't record all of the bedding. We'll record a few rolls of it and then go to the next field and show you that one. Just kind of like we did the disking video, but come along with us. Alright, we got the Jimmy Red bedded, the Hastings bedded, all we got left is what our garden and sweet corn at the house. 
Lino, come watch me today. I, this is probably the first time she's ever watched me bed land, maybe. You seen me do it before? Out the kitchen window. Yeah, from home. But she had never been out here and watched it. Um, it's, man, if I was gonna plant the baka, it'd work. If I was, you know, remember, we're gonna knock it down. This is just to get it to where we're ready to plant it. It'll be a nice, smooth surface. It won't be no valleys. It won't be no disc, what I call disc valleys. And uh, I know you can drag a field and all that, but uh, this is way, this is what I like doing with the equipment that I have. And it always works out real good. There's other ways to do it, but uh, this is what the JT West way. <laughs> so let's get her to the house. Super A's running great, man. Oh man, it's running great. Uh, couldn't ask for a better running tractor. I mean, it's, and you may have heard, you may have heard the engine start binding down a little bit on that Jimmy Redfield. I'm telling you, those 10 by 12 back feet is a load on one of these tractors, especially when it gets into deep, heavy soil. So uh, just letting you know, it's nothing wrong with the Super A, it's just a load. I've had it bind, I've had the 140 bind down with those back feet before, but let's ride down here and do this and we'll finish up the video. Okay guys, one big bedding video. All the bedding you want to see in one video. Not to say we won't bed anything else this year. I don't know of anything right off hand. Uh, we could. We may cut some more. Don't know of anything off hand. Uh, I am toying with the idea of raising two or three rolls of cotton, but I don't know. We may just plan it when we cut it, but uh, it was good. Next step is getting the planters on the tractor, getting the rolling cultivators on this tractor. Be the first time it's had rolling cultivators, so we'll get some rolling cultivators on that tractor and uh, get ready to, to plant. When we plant, it'll just be, okay, we're ready to plant. We'll go to the field. Blade's already on the 140, drop the blade, drop the planter get it all planted. Appreciate everybody watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, it was some mighty fine bedding. I am not disc poor anymore. And I got, even got some nice little smaller disc here. So there's nothing wrong with these. These are just smaller than what I would 
I want you guys to see what those big discs do. They really put up a row. But uh, y'all have a good week, a good day. We'll see you soon. Thank you for watching. God bless you.